Welcome to Lincoln Electric Cutting Systems. Today, we'll be reviewing the popular 4000 series product line and walking you through how easy it is to get started. The Torchmate 4000 series is available in three different table sizes with two different plasma cutters, allowing you to customize your machine to fit your needs. The Torchmate 4400 is our smallest machine available with 16 square feet of cutting area. This is just the right amount of space for users who handle small remnant cutting or are concerned about the footprint of the machine taking up too much valuable shop space. The Torchmate 4800 with 32 square feet of cutting area offers full plate capacity for processing a standard 4x8 sheet of material to completion. This is ideally suited for someone who is looking to stock manageable material sizes while increasing efficiency. The Torchmate 4510 offers the most cutting area of all 4000 series machines, 50 square feet worth, over 56% more cutting area than a 4800. When it comes to maximizing material utilization, space matters. The ability to load a 5x10 sheet allows you to fit bigger parts or a larger amount of smaller parts per each completed sheet. This maximizes uptime, saving you time and money. The two plasma cutters available on the Torchmate 4000 series machines are from Lincoln Electric's own FlexCut plasma cutting line. The entry level FlexCut 80 plasma cutter has a 40 to 80 amp output capacity and is rated to pierce up to 3 quarter inch mild steel. This unit operates on either single or three phase input power, making it more practical for small shops who may not have access to industrial three phase power, but may upgrade in the future. The FlexCut 125 is the big brother to the FlexCut 80. With 45 to 125 amps of output capacity, this three phase power only machine is built to cut thick plate. The 125 amp output allows you to pierce up to one inch thick mild steel with a 100% duty cycle. The FlexCut 125 also has an arc marking mode for part labeling, bend lines, and artistic features. Now we're gonna start the process from creating a part from CAD to cut. So we're gonna go ahead and import an image here. Place that down. For this, I'm gonna actually want an extra line. I just know that beforehand. So I'm gonna create an extra line from here to here and then do a little bend right there. From there, I'm gonna take my image itself, double click on it, come right up here to the vectorization button, press close, delete the image itself, select my part, go to arrange, make path. We're gonna to have to create a bridge on the O and the R. We'll come over here, create our bridge by drawing a little small rectangle. We'll then drag this part right over to here size to fit, create another bridge, so we'll copy that part over to here, move it around with the arrow keys if needed, select everything but this extra line that we made, do a basic weld, bada bing, bada boom, that outer part, the, this part here is done, so we can do a show fill to show that it will cut out properly. From there, all you have to do is create a tool path, output your part, save it on the flash drive, and you're ready to cut. So now that we've saved our job to the flash drive, we'll go ahead and insert it into the computer so that way we can load the job. From here, we'll go to select job. Make sure that our job is curve compensated to yes. We will browse, find the flash drive, load the job that we just created. We can see the visual representation of that if we go to the graphics tab. In the process setup, we'll wanna make sure to set our material type material thickness and amperage that we will be using. That will automatically set up all of your cut parameters. From here, we can go to dry run, turn the laser on. That way we can align our torch to the material in order to set the plate origin. So we will manually jog the torch to the bottom left-hand corner of the material. We will then go to plate setup, then set plate origin down here in the bottom left of that plate setup tab or window that pops up. We can close out of that window, and at that point, we're ready to run, and we just have to turn from dry run to active run, and then press run job. When using the correct settings, you can get quality parts just like this. 
If you don't want to run back and forth to your office to create parts, you also have the ability to use the shape library right here at the machine to create and use 37 different unique parts. So for instance, we can go ahead and cut this rectangle with four holes, select the process or type of cut that we want to use, so in this case plasma, adjust the size itself, make sure to adjust any of your lead-ins or lead-outs that you would like for your machine to cut. Go ahead and press OK, save it. If you already have an existing file, we can just save over that. It will automatically load that file in the graphics screen. Again, we get the preview. In the process setup, since we're going to be cutting thicker material, we've already changed our consumables, but we want to make sure to set up for 3 8 material. Turn our active run to dry run. Turn the laser on. Jog the torch down to where we want. Come back to the plate setup again. Set our plate origin. We can then go ahead and change from dry run to active run and run the job. Once your part has been cut out, we can go ahead and take it out of the table and we can look on the back and see that we have little to no dross accumulation. If you do have some dross accumulation, you should be able to just flick it off with your fingernail or drop it on the floor. The dross should come off very easily. The sides, your striations here should be pretty much straight up and down. The bevel angle for a conventional plasma should be about around five to seven degrees. The part itself should be fairly clean and be almost ready to use after some secondary processing. The Torchmate 4000 series tables were designed as all-in-one systems. That means that we make and support all of the components on the machine, from the plasma cutter, to the controller, to the table itself, and even the software. Lincoln Electric is the only manufacturer in this market that's able to provide this type of solution to you. We back this all-in-one system with a two-year warranty, meaning that this machine is going to be working for you for years to come. Give us a call today at 866-571-1066 or visit us at torchmate.com.